we finish this is what stay just a couple parts of silicon and uh, some caps wire so uh, now now I don't shut uh, the process I just uh, put some liquid soap in here and uh, make uh, black dust mud and uh, we go to the painting just a big shot look at that that looks nice I'm sorry about the wind but uh, it's a windy day okay okay we finish you see that gold all that yellow it's gold and uh, we, we leave uh, just a little sand because uh, if you if you make a pressure too much high you lose your gold uh, okay we go to the next step okay guys I just want to show you something look at that all that gold but uh, I don't know if you can see some of uh, golding gold uh, bonding wires are floating so if we remove uh, water just like this uh, if we spill the water we lose that gold so I spill that water through the filter and everything every dead gold I will collect through the filter I still got gold on some bowl I need to collect it's okay we go to filtering this okay we collect all the dust and the gold in the filter and we wait to finish okay guys now we put this filter with the wires and uh, from the fiber gold in the big jar so now we'll refine this I'm wearing a mask so sorry for my voice now it's important to you got a big jar then acid attack gold on a big surface okay that will be enough to cut so now we add the bleach I'm doing this outside today okay now we need the 50-50 bleach and acid so you add uh, half this cup on every 10 minutes now we're back for 10 minutes ok guys it's been uh, one hour after we start to uh, dissolve our gold so I add uh, two and a half cup uh, bleach now we got 50% uh, bleach and acid here and you to be sure just look from the down then if you don't see any golden wire your job is done now we're gonna filter this solution and we're gonna drop now we're gonna do some quick stenius test this is my old test so I don't sure I am not sure that he will work but uh, we will try oh shit okay you see it's positive for gold the drop so now we will add inside solution some water to dilute him you should be use uh, 
distillated water but uh, you can use uh, any water clean water we will add a free cup not much okay that will be enough And now we will precipitate our gold, 10 grams calcium metal sulfate, oh, you see how solution change color, is on colorless, this is a good sign. Okay. It's getting darker. I do that outside because the fumes, and I'm sorry if uh, you heard some wind. But uh, my house is uh, on a hill, but, and uh, it is always windy. Okay. Have a good reaction. Solution start uh, get uh, darker and darker. It's beautiful. It's a good feeling when you do it, do it something uh, right and uh, you have a prize at the end. Okay, that is it. Now we will leave it to settle down and we going to filtering and smell it. Smelt it. Just look at how it is dark. More one shot. And we leave it to stay. Good morning guys, we leave our solution to settle down and here, here is it, so you see, we got a nice gold inside and I want to just show you, uh, you, I don't know whether you see the difference, this is the BGA chips gold. And I got a different solution here. This is my uh, pins, folds, gold, and you see how it uh, is uh, darker and not the same color. Because uh, the BGA and other IT chips contains uh, wire 999. You don't need to refine any gold wire uh, you just can't uh, straight smell but uh, it's hard to, to remove all that plastic from the chips and uh, from the fiber so i do refine and in that way it's much easier now we're going to filter this solution from bj chips and i just want to show you You just take 
the piece of tissue and you put them here to keep your fine dust. And okay, now we filter this and I'll back when I finish. But before that, we do some quick stenio test, all right? To see if any gold stay on our solution. How you can see there is no reaction at all so our solution is clear and we could uh, waste him okay gold is in filter now so you don't ask that it's a double rinse with the water use dust plate and water and collect him to the center of filter it's much easier to smell smell and when you do this two times that's okay okay filter our gold so now we just take the filter out you see how it's dark. We lose some gold, but he's in the tissue. Now for the next, we don't need to smelt all the paper. We just cut in half. This bit of gold we're going to smell. This is going to do waste filter. We burn it later and we go to smoke now. Okay, I just want to show you something. You see, uh, before a couple of minutes, uh, that uh, IC chips and BGA chips, uh, gold is very heavy and uh, cloudy. Uh, but uh, you see that this is uh, my other jar uh, from the foils, and you see how it's fine dust almost floating in the water so in the solution so with this dust you need to be very careful but uh, when you do BGA chips you don't because uh, it's heavy just I want to show you this the compared two samples okay we are ready and now we go to smell uh, I do not show you how I smelt I show you in my last video and just we go to the result okay we finish smelt and this is our gold now we'll see how much we got so for uh, from uh, 100 grams BJ chips we finally get 0 0.4 grams pure gold and I still got something here I collect now maybe for the 001 gram but uh, 0 0.4 grams is uh, 100 grams BGA chips okay I hope you enjoy in my video so see you next time when we'll process something else goodbye guys